During the build-up to World War II, the St. Louis was a German ocean liner which carried more than 900 Jewish refugees from Germany in 1939 intending to escape anti-Semitic persecution. These refugees tried to disembark in Cuba and America but were denied permission to land. This project is a replica of the St. Louis ocean liner. In Berlin, on September 27, 1940, Japan, Germany, and Italy, and later in November, Hungary, came together to form the Tripartite Pact of Germany. These countries are then known as the Axis Powers. The pact is shown on the poster. This was a very big shift in the war, and it was talked about in many newspapers, so there are also numerous newspaper articles on the matter on the poster. The Pearl Harbor attack was a surprise aerial attack on the U.S. A total of 2,390 American service members and civilians were killed at Pearl Harbor. On that fateful day, an NBC radio officiate in Honolulu made an urgent phone call to New York. In it, he begins to describe what the world would later know as the attack on Pearl Harbor. This project, Breaking News, allows viewers to experience what Americans felt that day, listening to the terrifying phone call and soon watching the event unfold on television thanks to recorded footage. The Wannetsi Conference was held in the suburb of Berlin on January 20th, 1942. The agenda was to devise a plan that would render a final solution to the Jewish question in Europe, a euphemism for the liquidation of all European Jews. Depicted on the poster is a model of the estate in Wannetsi, Berlin that the conference took place in. The model highlights the position of the Nazi officials, planning and overseeing the deportation and extermination of 6 million European Jews. The Bataan Death March happened when Japan captured Manalia, the capital of the Philippines. The Japanese then forced the American and Filipino defenders of Luzon, the island on which Manalia is located, to march 65 miles from the southern end of the Bataan Peninsula to San Fernando. Thousands of troops died along this journey. The Doolittle Raid on Tokyo was an intense air raid on Tokyo from the United States. It provided morale for the Americans and it showed Japan's vulnerability to the United States. This project is an airplane with bombs falling from it to represent this air raid and the bombing from the U.S. onto Japanese territory. The Battle of Midway was a war between America and Japan six months after the attack on Pearl Harbor as another attempt at gaining power over the United States. This is a model of the airplane carrier boats during the war. The Angel of Death, whose name was Dr. Joseph Minkla, experimented on anything he deemed as unordinary with the goal of finding a way to cure them. The wings on the project are the clip wings of the Angel of Death, angelic in stature just like the intentions of Dr. Minkla, but haunting in appearance like the outcome of his experiments. On each wing there is a set of numbers that was given to a set of twins. The two sets differ by one digit, showing how the twins were given their set of numbers one after the other. Only once they were liberated in 1945 were most of the atrocities of the concentration camps brought to light. The workers in the camps were severely malnourished and weak and often died of starvation and disease. In Auschwitz-Birkenau, one of the most notorious concentration camps, one million people were killed. In all concentration camps, over three million people were killed. In this project, it shows some of the belongings of the people who went to the concentration camps, but unfortunately were not allowed to keep any of their belongings with them.
The Nazis massacred nearly 34,000 Jews and tossed their bodies into the Babi Yar, a ravine in the suburbs of Kiev. The rock formation represents this ravine. The sculpture represents the walls of the ravine where over 30,000 Jews met their deaths during the massacre. Attached to the sculpture are 30 LED lights, each one representing 1,000 Jews who lost their lives in the massacre. The Warsaw Ghetto was an act of Jewish resistance in the Warsaw Ghetto in German-occupied Poland during World War II to oppose the Nazis' final effort to transport the remaining ghetto population to death camps. The Jews fought valiantly for a month until the Germans took over the focal point of the resistance. The Warsaw Ghetto Uprising was the largest and symbolically the most important Jewish uprising, and it was the first urban uprising in German-occupied Europe. This painting is an abstract rendition of the well-known photo of the Gor Warsaw Ghetto Uprising. In the autumn of 1943, the Nazis began Operation Embellishment, the beautification process of Threisenstadt Ghetto to fool the Red Cross. Threisenstadt Ghetto is one of the strongest examples of how Nazis used the propaganda to fool society of their true goals. The 3D object portrays the camp after its beautification project, and the poster contains pictures of the camp. In 1944, the Allies prepared to invade Normandy, France. In preparation for the invasion, the Allies attacked other areas of France to prevent them from moving resources to Normandy, and they deceived the Nazis by leading them to believe that the Allies would attack Paz de Calais and Norway. Codename Operation Overlord, D-Day was the beginning of the end of the war. The Nazi book burning took place all around Germany from March until October 1933. Nazi party and college students rounded up and burned books from anywhere besides from Germany in order to eliminate any external influences. The project consists of a poster with a Jewish hand rising out of the burning pages that surround it and a burnt book with a Jewish passport of a Jew hiding his identity. These two represent the will of the Jewish people to up out of the ashes to try to burn them. This project is a 3D visualization of Mussolini, the head of the Italian fascist party during World War II's brutal public hanging, which was a significant event in history as some say it led to Hitler's suicide, which became the decline of World War II. On April 12, 1945, in Warm Springs, Georgia, President Franklin Delano Roosevelt suddenly died of cerebral hemorrhage. FDR was the 32nd President of the United States who was an extremely vital figure in World War II, whose efforts greatly aided the Allied powers in victory. The project is a 3D visualization of FDR's casket resting in the East Room in the White House. When Hitler committed suicide on April 30th, 1945, it was then that the Jews were able to see the light at the end of the tunnel. In this display, Hitler's grave at is attached to a tunnel from which light is emanating, symbolizing the beginning of a brighter time. Hiroshima and Nagasaki were two Japanese cities that America bombed to scare Japan into surrendering at the end of the war. The bombs were dropped with almost no warning and the force of the bomb was so strong that anyone within a few miles of the blast is integrated immediately. This exhibit portrays a before and after scene of the bombing in Hiroshima and Nagasaki.
This is the plaque that was set into the USS Missouri ship after the Japanese government signed the Japanese Instrument of Surrender, which was the written document that said Japan would surrender and end all hostilities in World War II. The treaty was signed in the USS Missouri while it was docked in Tokyo Bay. This day, September 2nd, 1945, would be known forever as Victory Over Japan Day or VJ Day. On May 8, 1945, the Allies formally accepted Germany's surrender. The German Institute of Surrender was signed in Berlin by the high command of the armed forces of Nazi Germany and the Allies, and the world celebrated the end of a brutal worldwide battle that had raged for nearly six years.